Hi friends! Today I'm gonna be making sticky summer somen noodles. Nagaimo is a yam that makes a slimy and sticky paste when you grate it. We love it so much, especially in summer. And okra also makes a sticky texture when you mix it with the sauce. The sticky and slippery texture is very appreciated in Japanese cooking because it has so many health benefits. It's good for your digestive system and helps you recover from fatigue. Let's prepare mensuyu, the dipping sauce for Japanese noodles. Put your katsuobushi and comb kelp in a pot. I am using thin sliced katsuobushi today, but if you find thick sliced katsuobushi, just go ahead and use it. It has a lot of flavor in it. Pour milling and soy sauce. Turn the heat to medium and when it reaches to a boil, turn the heat to low and simmer gently for 10 minutes. Allow it to cool to room temperature and pass through a sieve. This is a concentrated mensuyu, so dilute with the cold water before you serve. Now let's prepare the toppings. Slice boiled okra and set aside. Peel the nagaimo yam and cut into chunks. Put it in a plastic bag. Pound it into a slimy paste with a rolling pin. I used to use a grater to make a paste, but lately I found this method to make it into a paste. The small chunks still remain, but that adds texture and makes your noodles even tastier. Now boil the some noodles. I always use a frying pan to boil the noodles. It takes a much shorter time to cook. You don't really need to time to cook some noodles. It requires only 90 seconds. It depends on the package instructions, but in my experience, 90 seconds is the best to have a nice texture. After 60 seconds, add a quarter cup of water and bring it to a boil again. It will take 30 seconds. Drain and wash the noodles until the sticky stuff is washed away. Add ice cubes to improve the texture and create firmness. Drain well and drip off any excess moisture. Transfer the noodles in a bowl and topped with nagaimo paste and okra. If you cannot find it in your local grocery store, you can replace it with another vegetable like cucumbers or lettuce or tomatoes, anything you want. And for the final touch, Put some umeboshi, tear into small pieces, and put the seed in the mentsuyu sauce. Mash it into the mentsuyu to give a little bit of sourness to it. There you have your sticky summer somen noodles. Before you eat, you want to mix everything really well and all the stickiness that comes from the nagaimo and okra will stick everything nicely together and makes it so delicious. Actually, it makes it easy to eat and easy to bring it to your mouth. The mensu sauce is so flavorful and it makes such a satisfying lunch in the summertime. I hope you will give this recipe a try. Thank you for watching the video. Give me a big thumbs up and share the video with your friends and families. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Follow me on the social media and tag me on your post if you give it a try. And go to my website for the printable recipe and more information. And my store on Amazon has pretty much everything that I'm using in my video. Stay safe and stay healthy and I will see you soon. Bye!